We told you we'd be back. We want to hear you enjoying yourself. You're in big trouble, mister. W3L. 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 Ladies and gentlemen, we are one week away no from the summer no spectacle and what lineup it is. But what you're about to witness is last week our cameras were going to catch up with Drew Marshall against some comments, but Zero and Tormentor had other plans by attacking Iron Drew Marshall in his own dressing room. This beatdown occurred last week. Now, as you see myself and Wizard trying to get some order, trying to get those two out of the dressing room, trying to get some medical attention for Drew Marshall. And now we do hear from Dorothy Almadra Drew Marshall is on the hunt for a tag team partner. And Drew Marshall and that tag team partner will take on Zero and Tormentor in tag team action and it'll happen in air right here on the W3L network so there you see it ladies and gentlemen and of course all the other matches will be part of the W3L box office presentation but the way to see them first is of course to get your tickets to the Kirkcaldy Fife Ice Arena on June 17th one week from today and it's www.wthlwrestling.com for all of your ticket information. This week on WTL Wrestling Showdown, we have some exclusive comments from the Blood Tour of Liu King Sharp and a match he has personally requested in order to prepare for the merchandise Mike Musso in their dog collar match one week from today. Welcome to the longest wrestling show on YouTube, W3L Wrestling Showdown. Now, ladies and gentlemen, before we get to the action, we bring you some comments from the blood tourist, Lou King Sharp, who is set to face the merchandise Mike Musso in just one week in a dog collar match. Let's send it to the blood tourist and see what's on his mind. Here we are again, W3L Wrestling and Mike Musso. I don't think I've got the words left to emphasise just how I feel about Mike Musso. So lately, if you've not been watching, I've been using my actions to show how I feel about Mike Musso. And the first step of that was to take Mike Musso's copy to W3L heavyweight title and turn it into the W3L World Heavyweight title. I took that belt and I had more success with that championship than Mike Musso could ever dream of. And in taking that belt from Mike Musso, I placed him on the injury list. But Mike, Mike doesn't think. Mike came back and the king of wrestling in front of all of his W3L fans cut his big comeback shot and I left him a bloody mess in front of his family in front of his wife and in front of his children and he is no one to blame for my actions but himself and Mike Mike, I never ever doubted you as a wrestler. Ten that belt for you wasn't as easy as it seems. Fighting you has never been as easy as I make it seem. But now I'm questioning you, Mike, because what kind of man 
what kind of father would put himself in that situation again, Mike? Because after the summer spectacular, Mike, I can't guarantee that I'm going to leave you in a capable position to be able to provide for your family. And you have no one to blame for that but yourself, Mike. This isn't going to be a dog collar match. It's going to be a dog fight. Two dogs are going to nerf. And instinct's going to take over. They're going to... When I'm backed up against the wall, Mike, my instinct is to fight and fight and fight until I see black or till I stop seeing red. And Mike, I don't know if you've got that dog in you, but for your sake and for your family's sake, Well, ladies and gentlemen, we are outside one of those gala days again. And it's absolutely beautiful. Scorching here at ringside as Liu Kang Sharp makes his way to the ring. A false count, no disqualification matchup. Sharp clearly, pro clearly believes he's got something to prove by going into this dog collar match in just one week's time. It is definitely the road to summer spectacular. And he asked for the toughest man in Glasgow. Well, here's the prize fighter, Dean Ford. Dean Ford, not only well versed in the sport of professional wrestling, but well trained in mixed martial arts, Taekwondo, Karate, Aikido, and kickboxing. Dean yeah. Ford looking to put Sharp in his place and uh, you've got to wonder what it does to the mindset of the blood tourist should Dean Ford win this match. Start questioning if he's been sent the toughest, hardest man in Glasgow. Well, if Sharp gets in the ring, gets this contest underway, we'll find out if that's the case. Ladies and gentlemen, in addition, to the dog collar match. We also have the debut of Ravy Davy taking on Luke Aldridge. Luke Aldridge still looking for a win in three years. Unprecedented, the losing streak that Aldridge is on. And he looks to put the debut of Ravy Davy to a close by getting a win. Now taking his time. Slides back out, just toying here. Ford. Well, finally, Sharp's in the ring. He's still got the Singapore cane, however, no disqualifications in this match, so the cane is as legal as a headlock. Goes for the swing, misses, and look at that kick! There's the Taekwondo coming into play, and then there is the hip toss into the drop kick. And stand into the drop kick order, and well, we're going to get a suicide dive there. Didn't. Ford's behind him. Ford with a European uppercut. Oh. Uh, excuse me, ladies and gentlemen. Wizard! Wizard, could you get a message to Fiona, please? And back to, back to action. Sorry, folks. Sometimes. And look at that, using the barrier as a we weapon. And there's the Singapore Kane, ladies and gentlemen, WTL Women's Championship also on the line. It's also on the line 
It'll be a minute, we've got a cover. Two. WTL Women's Championship also on the line. Dynamite Brody Adler defending against the number one contender, Cassie King. And look at this now, choking Dean Ford. And um, we need to get some order here and get those fans back. A no disqualification, falls count anywhere in match. It's dangerous in an arena, an indoor arena, let alone outdoors. And where are we going now? Well, we're going up to the park area. Once again, we need to get those fans away. Misses the cane. Oh my, oh! Slam! Two only. Okay, security, we need to get, I need to radio security. Sharp, Sharp's climbing up the, look at that elbow. Two again. Ladies and gentlemen, what action happening right now? And just to remind you what else you're going to see, Summer Spectacular, triple threat match for the WTL Wrestling Showdown Championship. As the original Craig Stevens must defend against Hugo Harris and TJ Rage. And look at this, getting out the camel clutch by using the cane, Dean Ford did. Oh no! I've never seen two professional athletes using the children's play area as weapons. This is unheard of. And now, Looks like we're heading back. I think, but, well, our cameraman's a bit disoriented. Look, here we go, Shark now using the cane as a weapon. Now, I believe we're heading back. Well, ladies and gentlemen, our cameras will do their hardest to catch up. With all these fans around. And, oh, there we go. And we do not encourage our fans to throw one objects are our athletes. <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, just finishing off our summer spectacle. There's a two or three falls match for the WTL World Series Championship as Taylor Bryden cashes in his rematch against Doug Williams, who has stated that this will be his last match for a while, so therefore he could win the championship and take it and go home, and WTL would be without a heavyweight champion for a foreseeable. So a lot of pressure on tier zero, Taylor Bryden, one week, and Sharp was going for that. Frostman, oh my! Jumping, spinning, heel kick! Take a look at that again on a crafty connoisseur double feature. Then you see Sharp up on top, realised that Ford was going to move, but when he turned round, bam! And now Ford back to live action, Ford's in control. And 
corner it went in. Those rights. Now he's got the cane. <laughs> Oof! Takes Sharp out. Gets a two. Ford can't believe it. Ford now. Fireman's carry. TKO, total knockout. Lateral press, hooks the leg. Gets two. Four now. Hold it for one more. Fireman's carry. And look at this now, sharp. Using it, so I think a bandana to choke Ford out. There's not a thing the referee can do. Referee says that's it. Ladies and, ladies and gentlemen, looking Sharp's going to win this match by submission. Has he done enough to make a believer out of you? Has he done enough? Wait a minute. Fans just jumped in the ring. Oh, decided better. I'm not going up against Slu King Sharp. Not after what he's been through and going to go through. But has Sharp done enough to make a believer out of W3L? They can go one on one with Missile in a dog collar match. Wait a minute. My Missile! I'll see you! Well, there you go, you hear it there from Sharp. Ladies and gentlemen, from all of us on the team, we'll see you next Sunday.